Multiplexes up to four units and four-story apartments like these could become more common in Winnipeg. The changes would allow up to four units on a single lot anywhere in the city, and up to four stories within 800 meters of frequent transit routes. Residents like Ray Hessline raised the alarm that the plan would take away the right to appeal developments. The right of appeal of these variances is the only means by which residents could try to improve the infill. Others, like Brian Pilcott, cheered on the proposal. Cities grow, change, evolve over time. What this is doing is to say what it can grow and change over time into is expanded a little bit. The plan divided councillors. Some, like Waverly West Councillor Janice Lukes, enthusiastically supported it. We have to be bold in what we are doing going forward. <laughs> Others, like St. Patel Councillor Brian Mays, have vocally wow. opposed it. I just think that this is a very flawed process, and I think it's uh, very top-down from the federal government. Mayor Scott Gillingham tried to ease some concerns about how quickly change would come. So it's not like we would adopt something today that would permit what the federal government wants us to permit, and then suddenly overnight, you know, the city would be filled with uh, four-story fourplexes everywhere. That's, that's simply not the case. Other cities had their funding approved after making the changes. Calgary today received more than $200 million.